Welcome to Jessica Stories. This is your Sabbath thought. These thoughts are short and heavily influenced by the Come Follow Me program created by the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. My hope is that these short messages will prepare your mind and heart for tomorrow's Sabbath worship. Welcome to today's Come Follow Me Scripture Thought. My thought comes today from the book of Enos. It is one chapter, but it is jam-packed with so many awesome nuggets of truth, of inspiration, and encouragement. So I'm going to share two verses with you. The first verse is 15, verse 15, chapter (laughs) 1. Now, we've learned about Enos's mighty prayer, his wrestle before God, and how he received a remission of his sins, how he spoke to God and at and prayed about his brethren and about the Lamanites. And then the Lord teaches him something. And this is in 15. And the Lord says to him, Whatsoever thing ye shall ask in faith, believing that ye shall receive in the name of Christ, ye shall receive it. Oh my goodness, I'm so, so, so grateful for this lesson, for this counsel, for this guidance that our Lord God gives to us through Enos. And I'm so grateful that Enos chose to put this in his record. As I have got to live these 34 years of life, I have been able to develop a testimony of this truth that when we ask in faith, believing that we will receive in the name of Christ, I found that I have received answers. I've received peace. I've received comfort. I've received direction. I've received protection. I've received knowledge and wisdom. I've received forgiveness and so many other glorious blessings I encourage you, if you have questions or if there are things that lay heavy upon your heart, ask in the name of Christ. Ask in faith, believing that you will receive it. And I know you will. Most likely, you will not receive it the way you anticipate or the way that you hope or the way that you are looking for. But you will receive it. It may not be on your timeline, And it may not even be in this life. But I have faith that we will receive it when we need it. And I wanted to uh, share one last scripture. And that's the very last scripture. And it's basically Enos's testimony. And you know, he only has 27 verses. That is what he recorded of his whole life. And they are so inspiring and encouraging. His testimony says, And I soon go to the place of my rest, which is with my Redeemer. For I know that in him I shall rest. And I rejoice in the day when my mortal shall put on immortality and shall stand before him. Then shall I see his face with pleasure. And he will say unto me, Come unto me, ye blessed. There is a place prepared for you in the mansions of my Father. Amen. I am inspired by Enos, by his confidence in his Savior. I know that he knew his Savior, and I strive to be like him so that I can leave my testimony that I know that I will get to rest in my Savior and that there will be a mansion prepared for me. Jesus said, come follow me. Take my yoke upon you You can rest from your labors If you let me walk with you Come follow, come follow Come follow me today I will lead you and guide you If you follow me